Barstool Sports are coming back at you. All right, welcome here, Totem Pole Sports. We're the actual common man. I'm going to go ahead and start off by saying $79 hoodies for the common man. $79 hoodies. Where are they made? They made by little kids out in China. They're out little kids out in Thailand. Oh, I don't know if Taiwan is, is part of China. I don't know if I'm allowed to say that. But Barstool, y'all got 100 people talking about a whole lot of things that ain't sports. I could take a drink and start chucking and say, oh, my gosh, that tastes really good. First beer out of Pennsylvania. That's amazing. Walmart sells Russell sweatshirts for under $20. I can go get a custom shirt made for under $20. You're just sitting there trying to make billions of dollars. Yeah, sure. The world revolves around money. Everything goes back to money. Dan Snyder selling this thing. The criminal, financial, whatever the hell you want to call it. It is ridiculous. You guys are not even about sports you're about barstool conversations having a beer at the barstool saying look at the breasts on that woman over there look at the smoke show your website is trash it is just nothing it looks like a tiktok person just sat there and said let me just put all this stuff together all this jank about nonsense about he said she said stuff where's the sports if you're going to uh, literally get bought out and put together with a gambling website don't you think people want to see sports and what's going to happen on the field? Maybe get a little insight on how to make some money on sports gambling? Might make a little bit more sense. But I guess there are some dummies that go to your site and pay $80 plus shipping for some really crappy uh, sweatshirt, right? Our lawyers, they told us that we were... Our, <laughs> they told gonna, us that we were great. Yeah. They said we're going to ally with you, but we're not going to ally with you. It makes no sense because we are the common man. That is what we do. We spend hours and hours and hours a day coaching the youth of America, watching sports videos, watching tape, watching film, dissecting what's going on on and off the field. And we're not sitting here saying, oh, well, let me try out this new nonsensical uh, soda and maybe puke it up for some views, trying the same pizza slice 6,000 times, right? We are the actual voice of America. We are not some nonsensical billion-dollar industry about nothing. This is nothing that y'all are putting out there. right? We got 4,000 subscribers, Totem Pole Nation. Every single one of them is real. We don't have all this stuff that we've got 16 writers talking about, again, some girl's breasts. We don't have 16 writers talking about the way that some guy takes a slap shot in the NHL. We actually discuss things that are really happening. We don't have to put product placement, stuff like that. Oh, product placement. Thanks, Powerade. We like it. We drink it. That's all we need to do. We don't need to start chugging that stuff. Coach Lambo, tell them what it's like. Well, first of all, Barstool, I mean, I just get sick of y'all. I mean, y'all really think y'all that good. I mean, remember y'all said Virginia State wasn't a school? We are the low man or the totem pole. But according to Barstool, Barstool said – Virginia State isn't a school. Virginia State isn't a school. First of all, the topic was what was the best stadiums played or was it what is the hardest place to play? And I, you meant to say Virginia Tech, but you said Virginia State and then said it wasn't a school. And then you have this fat guy on Barstool named Big F. Who is Big F? I mean, this guy looks like a sweet potato haddish, like I'm about to chop him on his neck off. I mean, this guy, what, he said he got the best double vodka in the world? You can't even drink vodka, buddy. I mean, you need to lose all them fat and all your nipples that you got because you have no drip game. I mean, then you have some weird guy named Billy Football. Is he even in America, by the way, or is he from China? I can't even tell. Then you got some stupid guy named Billy Football. Billy Football. So, first of all, why is your name Billy? Who raised you? Did your parents raise you, or did you even grow up with parents? You just grew up out of a dinosaur's mouth or something. I mean, Lord knows I can't tell. I mean, you have all these people. I mean, who is who is this chick right here? Brianna Chicken Fry. <laughs> Brianna Chicken Fry. I'm going to go after our owner, by the way. All right? Brianna Chicken Fry. That is the worst name in the world. And you're not that attractive, girl. You're not that attractive. You're not Beyonce, you're not Holly Berry, and you're sure not Jesus right here. <laughs> Dave, let me tell you something, though. 
I enjoy watching a rough and rowdy. But what I'm going to say is, if I was out there rough and rowdy, there would be not a single person that could stand toe-to-toe with me. I will take it there. You bring me out there, we'll put on a show. You're talking to somebody that has professional wrestling experience. You're talking to somebody that has Division I football experience. And you're listening to somebody that actually knows that Virginia State is in Petersburg, Virginia, and has a football team that's 6-3. and three. Right? Stop selling $80 hoodies. It doesn't make sense. It is absolutely ridiculous just trying to milk the American money machine. I don't know who's your attorneys or who's your financial, you know, whatever the hell you want to call them, right? But you got all these different coaches and stuff like that. We're not going anywhere. We're going to stay right here. Totem Pole Nation coming at you live every single week. Live streams, shorts, video clips. We got characters except the real people. I want to compete compete against Barstool. you. I want to go against y'all. So, Barstool, you better accept our challenge because we're going to kick your ass. Tonal Pulse Sports, we're out.